uh, this macron is unregulated in the uh, uh, majority of the uh, tumor tissue examined. And uh, uh, as I mentioned, the, uh, the bioinformatics software identified the FBX031 uh, as uh, one of the targets of the micro C. Then we found that um, FBX031 is abrogated in the FRs in the chemical decision cells. We did the best plots to confirm the results, to confirm the predi prediction. And uh, uh, the date is as we predict, uh, as, we uh, as we suggested, the micro 29 c can downregulate the protein regression of the FBX031 in the uh, two cell lines. And then uh, the next uh, Variability assay, we found that over erosion of the FBX031 uh, could enhance uh, could, uh, could promote the chemical resistance of the cancer cells to uh, fail FBO treatment. And uh, mm, next, we over erased microtracinic C and uh, found that microtracinic C can uh, downregulate uh, the uh, chemical resistance of the cancer cell to fail FU treatment. And after all regression of the FU echo 31, this protein or regression, and then the effects were abrogated. Uh, next, uh, we, we, we uh, confirmed the, the role of the FU echo 31 in resistance of the cancer cells uh, to cisplatin. Uh, the other uh, common use the drugs in treating uh, esophageal cancer. And we found that the uh, overregression of the ADS protein uh, could uh, uh, enhance the resistance of the cancer cells to uh, cisplatin. And uh, conversely, the downregulation of the this protein could uh, uh, reverse the, the resistance, resistance of the red uh, cells to cisplatin. Uh, next, we uh, 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 studied the mechanism how the FBX031 regulates chemical resistance. Uh, this MKK6 is a regulator of the, P, uh, of the MAPK uh, P38 uh, uh, signaling pathway. And we found that uh, uh, from the uh, OIP essay, we found that uh, the FBX031 could uh, bind to the uh, uh, MAK MAKK6 and also as confirmed in the uh, reverse for ID. And we found that uh, we, we, uh, we, uh, in the uh, cells uh, knock is knocked down of the FBI society one and the control cells, which traces the two different uh, cells with the uh, 6x and determine the, the uh, uh, regular. Uh, determined the protein degradation rate, found that uh, uh, knockdown of this protein and could, uh, uh, in, uh, could, uh, uh, could uh, uh, promote the degradation, pro promote the protein degradation of the MKK6. And uh, uh, from the Western, we confirmed that the knockdown of the uh, FBX031 and uh, could induce the P, uh, induce the phosphorylation of the P38. And next, we determined the, the, uh, the regression of the microarray 29 c and uh, the, this protein in some uh, cancer cell lines and the teeth uh, in, in the cancer cell lines and found that there is some uh, inverse correlation. Uh, so this is the conclusion. The micro 29 c over regression could reverse acquire a chemical resistance of the chemical resistant cells. And uh, this protein uh, mediates the suppressed effects of the, of the micro 29 c on chemical resistance of the esophageal cancer chemical resistant cells. Okay, thank you very much. Thank you, thank you very much. Thank you very much. Uh, any question from the audience?
they, they don't. Uh, so what's what's the, the, the next steps? What are the next steps for you? Uh, the, nec uh, make, uh, the next step of our study, uh, as you can see, uh, we just compared uh, a small number of the, uh, we just compared the aggression of the microRNA and protein in, in very small number of clinic tissue. And we will uh, determine the expression of this microRNA and this protein in a large number of clinic tissue and to determine whether there is a really inverse correlation between the microRNA and the protein. And also, uh, the, the animal experiments, uh, uh, yeah, we, uh, yeah, we have established the stable cell line of the microTNC and this protein, and also the cell line over aggression, uh, uh, the microTNC and also the protein. We will, uh, uh, will compare the resistance of the different uh, uh, stable cell lines to the uh, FU uh, treatment and also this vaccine treatment. Uh, in the animal, in the mice. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Um, in, in, in terms of, uh, because we are in chemotherapy uh, session, in terms of uh, with the therapy, you already a bit of that, but what is uh, the body draw in the future uh, of this approach? Meaning, is it a new drug? I see you possibilities or treatments uh, for the or resistance uh, answer. Yeah. Uh, increasing evidence uh, shows that uh, the injection of the microRNA to the, the uh, possible treatment for uh, human cancer. And uh, some preclinical study show that the, uh, some, uh, uh, some microRNA were packages with some nano particles, yeah. Yeah, and then uh, uh, IV injected into the device or intra, intra yeah. Yeah. Uh, yeah, and uh, see some effects, yeah. Mm -hmm. And uh, our study on another macro, yeah, we have done some, we have, we have, we have did some uh, animal experiments and uh, to determine why there is the effects of the, the injections in macro and, uh, uh, and the, and the, on the tumor growth uh, and the, the metathesis. Other yeah, there was uh, a lot of variability in the expression of it uh, in uh, your cases. Yeah. So, like Hotter just presented earlier, it could distinguish between the patient who will get, could benefit or not. I do. Did I well understood? Because when you presented the cases and the expression, yeah. it was a big difference between the first case and the third case in the expression of the MIR So it's different from one person to another person, yeah? Yeah, yeah, yeah. The expression. Yeah, it's different, yeah. yeah. Some so you may divide or select the patients who have higher, who could response to them, or could not respond. So yeah, yeah. So whom the resistance yeah. will be diminished or not? Yeah. Like a very interesting Yeah, yeah, I think yeah, I think it's possible implementation, yeah. Because different patients have different versions of this microRNA. Yeah. Yeah. Many many thanks. We are right at this time. Yeah. Oh yeah, oh sorry, sorry. Yeah. This is for you. Thank you very much.